Hey, what's up, guys? It's Noah from Pet Zone. Um, so here we have Tom Bars Aquascape right here. This is an ADA 60P. Um, we've got a variety of different um, levels of plants, just foreground plants. This is Elio Paris, the Seculares Mini. Um, we have some pearlweed scattered throughout. Right here we have some Rotala Vietnam. Um, in the back we have Pogo Samon Erectus and your Rotala Rotundifolia right here and some Luigia Super Red in the back. Um, the hardscape is Tom Bar's Manzanita Wood and Tom Bar's El Pepe Stone. Um, we do run CO2 injection on this tank and we use um, an Eheim Echo filter. Um, on to the next tank, we have um, this aquascaper here. It's a UNS um, 75 liter tank, um, which is around maybe like 30, 35 gallons. And this is this was aquascape by Solo Aquaria and South Bay Aqua. Um, those are their Instagram handles. And this is a really low tech tank, um, really low tech light. Um, has some jungle val, some marsilia hirsuta, some anubius copifolia, um, and some other crypts in here. So it's a really nice aquascape. It has some exodon tetras. Um, it says right here the meter that brought us. Um, down here we have Chris's biotope tank. This is a UNS 60U. And a biotope is just mainly to resemble. Um, the natural habitat of the fish. So we have some jungle bow right here, some Malaysian driftwood, and we have some rubber nose tetras. On to the next tank. We have Ryan's um, cube tank right here. We have some mosses right here. This is Christmas moss. We have some clay moss. We have some pearlweed in the front, some Monte Carlo. We have some Cryptocrine Spiralis tiger right here, some booths, um, some Crypt Parvo over there, um, some Dora Paragraphs, some Glossostigma. And right here, we also have the Anubius White. Pretty rare in the hobby. And we have probably one of our most um, notable tanks, our Trinity display right here. This is a 114 gallon tank um, from UNS. And we have a variety of different plants right here. Um, a little story about why this tank is called Trinity is because it combines three different aquascaping styles, such as um, the Dutch aquascape, uh, Iwagumi, and also the nature um, aquarium style scape. So we tried to incorporate all those elements. We have some, like for example, some Scripwentii bronze, some Hygrophylla, uh, Cymenses, Hornbosa, Aerocolon Vietnam, Alternathera Renekii, some Boos, um, and we have this huge Tiger Lotus in the back. We also have some Lobelia Cardinalis in the foreground, um, some Mermaid Weed in the middle with some Bacopa. That one's different. Some Lavidia Reapins in the back, along with some Amania Gracilis in the back as well. And we have our foreground carpet. And on to our next display. And probably one of my um, favorite displays in the store right now. We have the Continuum series of Aquascapes. So, right here, these were both done by the Pet Zone team. We have First continuum tank, we have some um, some uh, water celery right here, or yeah, water celery. <laughs> um, I'm, I'm blanking out on the name, guys. If I remember it, I'll say it again. But anyways, we got our pearl weed in the foreground. We got some um, AR mini right here. We have some Rotala H Raw right there. And yeah, so those are all the plants in this tank. Oh, we also have some Aerocolon Vietnam right here as well. 
We have, this is the second continuing tank right here. We have some thermal weed in the foreground, um, which has completely taken over this tank. We have some Anubius right here. Some, so this plant right here is actually immersed Ammonia gracilis. So the stem actually gets really, really big. And it's actually flowering, which is also really cool. Let's see the flowers. And we got some Christmas moss um, right here as well. And so those are all of our main aquascapes here, guys. Oh, one more actually. We have Sean's River Tank. This is probably a fan favorite. Um, this is a unique concept that we use for a really long and shallow tank. River style aquascape. And we were, mi we were mixing around with some um, emergent plants as well. So we have some hydrocotyl tripartia right here. We have some cardamine lyrata right here as well. And some dwarf hair grass in the mix as well. Add some variation. And we even have a little oop, Totoro right there. Just dropped in. Those are our main aquascapes here, guys. So make sure you check us out and have a great day, guys.